There are a lot of moving parts when a concert comes into a venue. In this case, we're providing racks and stacks. As well as flown lighting. That means the band is carrying their own mics, consoles, monitor package, and backline. We provide front of house PA cabs and amplifiers. The band is also carrying a deck lighting package and a video wall. That will have to interface with our flown lighting package. And that means providing DMX cabling as well as a DMX patch sheet. This is the DMX snake landing at front of house. Since we're not using our multi-pair audio snake, I'm using a similar Cat5 setup here for drive lines from front of house. The four sends are left, right, sub, and fill, and these go from front of house to the DSP and amps at the stage. A clean stage is a happy stage. No matter how large or small the production, always use well thought out cable paths to leave the stage uncluttered. And strive to run your cables in straight lines with 90 degree turns. It's not about the shortest distance between points for a cable run. It's about the cleanest path for a cable run. Whether you are the provider or the band, mark and color code your cables and your equipment. Not just for identification, but so you can quickly and efficiently place and connect things the same way each time. For something like DMX fixtures, label them by their position and or their address. Then hang or position them accordingly. There's no need to completely have to repatch or readdress your fixtures for each gig. All right, back to the gig. Once everything's in place, it's time for a line check. And after that, it's time for a full band check. Once sound check is done, venue staff starts last minute preparations before the doors open. Here's a pre-show look at front of house before the crowd arrives. And then it's showtime. And then it all goes out. The band gets loaded out first before we start flying things in. This is where organization and marking things again comes in handy. Everything has a place to live in the trucks. It doesn't just go randomly in cases. Always strive not to put things in the way of the other departments. Nobody wants to move things twice. Everything should flow in a safe, efficient order. Following these same rules on smaller shows not only helps the smaller shows go together and strike quicker, but prepares you for larger shows. 
If you haven't seen the sound check in action video, here's a link to that. Leave any comments or questions below. Check out the other videos. Don't forget to like and subscribe, and I will see you next time.